before any hinge adjustments are carried out, it is important to check that the door has been installed correctly, is true and plumb in the opening, and that any glazing has been correctly toe and heeled. Whilst it is possible to make minor adjustments to the door hinges in order to move the door sash from side to side and in and out, if it is not installed correctly, it will not operate correctly. You may need to make these adjustments if the door is catching on the lock style or hinge side. In order to move the door sash from side to side, as in closer or further away from the locking style, you'll first need to remove the central cover cap from the hinge. This will allow you to access the lateral hinge adjustment screws. Using a spanner or allen key, adjust the door sash as required. Turning the screw clockwise will move the sash closer to the lock style. Turning it anti-clockwise will move the sash away from the lock style. There is approximately four millimeters of movement. Please remember that it is important to make the same adjustment to all the hinges. Once you've adjusted the hinges, you can open or close the door to ensure that the locks are engaging correctly. If they are engaged correctly, you'll be able to lift up the handle to the 11 o'clock position. This will allow you to turn the key and lock or unlock the door. Once you are happy with operation of the door, replace the cover caps. You may need to make these adjustments if the door is catching on the bottom or the top of the frame. In order to move the door up and down, as in closer or further away from the bottom of the frame, you'll first need to remove the cover cap from the underside of the hinge. This will allow you to access the vertical hinge adjustment screws. Using an Allen key, adjust the door sash as required. Turning the screw clockwise will move the sash closer to the top of the frame. Turning it anti-clockwise will lower the sash. There is approximately four millimeters of movement. Please remember that it is important to make the same adjustment to all the hinges. Once you have adjusted the hinges, you can open or close the door to ensure that the locks are engaging correctly. If they are engaged correctly, you'll be able to lift up the handle to the 11 o'clock position. This will allow you to turn the key and lock or unlock the door. Once you are happy with operation of the door, replace the cover caps. It is important to use an Allen key to tighten the locking screw that can be found on the inside of the hinge when the door is in the opening position. Tightening this screw will prevent the door from moving during everyday use.